join me as we tour the beautiful Windmill Island Gardens in Holland, Michigan. We started entrance of the beautiful gardens that had flowers everywhere. We visited in June, so the famous tulips were already gone, but the flowers were stunning nonetheless. The pathway of gardens led us to the famous windmill itself, Dijuan, which was brought over from the Netherlands in 1964. The two sets of double doors on the ground floor allowed the farmers to drive their horse and wagon full of bagged wheat right into the mill. The flour is ground on the fifth story of the mill, so farmers would have to use the elevator to convey the bags up to the grinding floor. However, for tourists, the staircase is much more efficient. Take a look at some of the original pieces and parts of the mill mounted on the wall for us to touch and examine. We walked out onto the gallery deck, which was so beautiful, you could see all the gardens below and some of the town of Holland. The blades of the mill are massive. They are 80 feet long and six feet wide. Our next pathway through the beautiful garden led us to the charming replica structures, including a wayside inn, fisherman's house, and an orphanage, and more stunning flowers, some of we had never seen before. And more trails of flowers as we lead back to the parking lot. This was one of the funnest things that we did in Holland, Michigan. So don't worry if it's not tulip time, there is still plenty to do. Visit the Dijuan Windmill and Windmill Island Garden.